Good morning, good morning, good morning. It is Thursday and that means new time slot for me, Intensati in the morning, which I'm actually super excited about because a few weeks ago I was like, I really need to find a way to have Intensati in my life every single morning and teach it every morning or something to really bring myself to to teach it and to do it every morning. And so I'm super, super grateful and excited that I was able to, to switch my time slot to a morning slot because I feel like the best way to, to start the day is really by harnessing our power of our hearts through this practice, set the intention for the day and start strong. So I'm gonna give you a preview of what we're gonna do today. So I tune into my good. I celebrate my power. I savor my good fortune. To serve is my honor. Yes, yes, that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna take you through this practice, through this embodiment and state awakening, state generate, generative practice, which I, which I so believe in. And it's, uh, it's such a blessing to be able to, to do this with you all on a daily basis. Um, you know, a few years ago, uh, Patricia, the founder of Intensati, left her, uh, day job basically at equinox in new york city and uh, which meant that the whole schedule of intensati reshuffled she was offering more online classes and all that um but you know with the changes also sometimes you fall off certain certain routines and i was at the time doing intensati basically every day it's like really you know it was really kind of like this fortifying in my heart and now with this new reality we're able to do it uh, every morning ariana you remember the days in which we did intensati basically every day right i mean that was really something and we're back at doing it um so i'm super excited to teach this particular block uh, i tune into my good i celebrate my power because lately um you know i think that for everybody um i don't know i i feel like everybody has some sort of version of their own way of saying um this pandemic has brought something up in me or i'm really reprioritizing my life i'm doing things differently i want to do things differently moving forward and for me um it really is a recognition that i have I spend my life um, basically doing things for the future. So I work today so that I can make money for the future, or I work today so I can save today so I can go on this vacation, or um, I, you know, I uh, do, I harness my YouTube channel, I harness my social media channels so that I can reach a bigger audience for future things, right? And while I do everything with, you know, not everything, I mean, I have my days, but I do a lot of things with my heart, right? And I, and I really believe in a heart-centered practice and I really have harnessed and, and trained myself to be in the present moment. I had this huge realization that I have been living every day to build something in the future, as opposed to really doing something every day and building every day to just build it every day and to just live every day. Because the truth is we only have today. So uh, I have had this enormous shift in my life in, in, in which I was also able to realize why I'm procrastinating so much and why I sometimes I'm so, you know, full force forward and sometimes I just like, I, I just don't wanna do this anymore because I'm, I'm always looking ahead as opposed to really living in the now. And so this, is a, a series that resonates with me so much in, in really embodying this notion that I turn into my good now. I celebrate my power that I have now. I celebrate how far I have come today. And I celebrate what I want to do today. I savor my good fortune that I have today. And I am here to serve today. And you know, and whatever makes me feel good today, that will propel me forward. And uh, so, you know, we, in the evolution, which is Patricia Moreno's online program, we have wisdom circles and I am the leader of the entrepreneur wisdom circle. And we have decided for this month and as a community as well, to really focus on building every day to build a week that builds a month, that builds a year, that builds a life. So really still focusing on today with the big picture still in mind. So. I want to throw it back at you and see where in your life maybe you are more focused on tomorrow than you are on today and where in your life you feel like you could be more present um you you know more present for your life i definitely can be more present for my life literally in everything that i do but also in realizing that sometimes i don't do things because i feel like i can do it in the future like i, I don't have to call this person i can do it tomorrow and then in the end you know a lot of the times i don't get to it because tomorrow something else will happen so i invite you to close your eyes and take a deep breath in 
to start steadying ourselves and steadying our heart and really going to our hearts and exhale and inhale again. And as you hold your breath now, really connect to your heart and see where can you be more present in your life and exhale and inhale and hold it. Can you be more present with your loved ones? Can you be more present with your children? Can you be more present with your family? Can you be more present with your work? Can you be more present with your craft and exhale? Take a deep breath in. Can you be more present when you meditate? Can you be more present when you work out? Can you be more present when you cook and exhale? And last time, take a deep breath in and hold it. Can you be more present when you walk through your house, when you walk through your apartment, when you walk through the grocery store, when you select the best fruit, the best mango, the best orange, can you be more present then? And exhale. And open your eyes and stand in a ready pose as we start with our warm up. Shoulders back, back straight. Look ahead with intention and bring your hands up, 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 and your arms straight up, up above your head and suddenly say to yourself, today I take full responsibility for the way that I live my life and for the presence that I bring to my life, for how present I am in everything that I do today. Bring your hands to your third eye and suddenly say to yourself, today I take full responsibility for my thoughts. And I choose to be present for my thoughts and to my thoughts so that I can choose thoughts that empower me, thoughts that make me feel the way that I want to feel. And I am not a victim of my thoughts. Bring your hands to your heart and suddenly say to yourself, today I take full responsibility of my attitude. And today I have an attitude of presence in everything that I do. And even if I don't, I don't feel present throughout the day. I am going to commit and take responsibility for being present in this moment, being connected to this practice and to my body. Take your hands down as an arrow, down to the floor by blessing a little bit and, and, and coming into your knees back straight and silently say to yourself today, I take full responsibility for my actions. The way that I show up in the world, the way that I let my feelings and my thoughts determine which actions I take. I take full responsibility to be the master of my own actions. All together. Up for two, forehead, hard floor. Up for two, forehead, hard floor. Up for two, forehead, hard floor. Up for two, and now we say every day, in a very true way. I co-create my reality again. Every day in a very true way. I co-create my reality. Every day in a very true way. I co-create my reality. Just think it. Because every day, things happen in our lives. Things happen that we can't control. What we can control is how the, the attitude that we bring to them, how we choose them. Last time, step to your right. As above, so is below. This is what I know. So two up, two down, four singles. Four, three, two, one. As above, so is below. This is what I know, again, as above in my thoughts, so is below in my life, this is what I know, again, as above, so is below, this is what I know, just think it, and as you go into your knees, really feel your body wake up, again, up for two, down for two, for singles, and take it from the top every day in a very true way. I co-create my reality. Step out. As above, so is below. This is 
what I know again every day in a very true way. I co-create my reality. Step out as above, so is below. This is what I know. Go to warrior, warrior. There you go. Warrior, warrior pose, hands out, knees bent, back straight, power, pulse, pulse. Wake yourself up, wake yourself up in your legs. Come on, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good job. Let's start with the first move. It's uplift, uplift. Hands go like this. Yes, yes, we uplift our energy. I love this move. It's so simple, but it makes me feel so happy. It really makes me feel so happy. Such a great move. Because I really feel like I'm actually moving my body in a highly energetic way and fluffing my whole energy around me. Don't you love it? I love it, continue, continue. Go on, go on. I tune into my good. 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 Yes, yes. Again. I tune into my good. 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 Just think it. Just think it. Your legs can go the way you want them to go. You tune into your good. Our good. We're all good. We have goodness in us. Everything that comes out of good that we don't like about ourselves or that creates some sort of challenging feeling is just coming from fear. And when we tune into our good, we can unlock that internal power that allows us to be so open, so loving, bring so much good to the world, and that liberates us from the grip that our mind sometimes has. Yes, yes, let's do it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, great. Up, celebrate, great. Yes, yes, great. Woo, also, legs can go however they want them to go. You can put them up, whatever you need. Whatever you need, whatever level you want. You're the master of your body. You're the master of your energy. But sometimes you need a little push, right? That's right. I pray, hang on, again. I celebrate my power, yes, yes. I celebrate my power. Woo -woo. I celebrate my power. I celebrate my power. Let's do a sprint. Up, knees up. Come on, come on, let's do it. Bring that energy up. Celebrate the power you have. The power of your legs that carry through you through your life. The power of your being. Then if you can't move your legs, if you're sitting down, you feel strong with your upper body. Yes, yes. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, up, lift. Woo! Great. Up, lift, up, lift. And great. Right. Woo! 
Yes, yes. Now we use our legs, okay? Let's start. We count this hop. So we create this huge kind of circle around us. The circle that is the magnitude of our heartfulness, of our mental power. It symbolizes our mental power and our heart power. This is how much you actually can reach. Yes, yes. You can reach so far beyond yourself, so far beyond your actual organ. It's incredible. Hi, sorry. Are you working out with us? Yes, yes. Woo, woo. That's right. That's right. Left and right. I savor my good fortune. 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 Eight, seven, six, five, four, let's do a sprint. Let's do a sprint, come on. Move those legs. We've been working so much with our arms so far. Move those legs. Up, up, come on, let's do it. Come on, move those legs. Wake them up. You can do it. You have the power. You have the power. You can do it. You can do it. You are good. You are the goodness personified. And we're bringing up our power. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, high five. Very powerful, my friends, very powerful. Good job. Okay, last move. It's not, not easy, not a calm down. We're gonna do jumping jacks. So let's start by with the arms and tap, tap. our breath and we're gonna focus on we're gonna focus on serving yes yes we serve to serve is our honor Woo! jump yes yes jump we're here to harness our power we're here to really call up the power in the depth of our heart yes yes Woo! To serve is my honor. 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 Just take it. Jump. Just feel it. Just feel like it's moving to life. With the goodness coming out of you. With the power that you know you have. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Again. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Good. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Harness. Woo! Good. Now. Good. And now. Good. Now. I serve as my honor. I savor my good fortune. To serve is my honor. I savor my good fortune. To serve is my honor. One more time. Just think it. Just think it and feel it. Woo! We go back to a plank. Great, great. And good. Now, now. Uplift. Great. And good. Now. Oh, I just turned into my good. I celebrate my power. I still serve in my honor. I turn into my good. I celebrate my power. I turn into my good fortune. To serve is my honor. Woo! Again. Great. Good. 
one. And now, okay, we're gonna do it one more time with our deformations. All right, all right, come on, come on, great. Woo, same girl. Now, one more time, one more time, up lift. Fast, 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 great, great. Call it up, call it up, call it up, good. Good, good, good. And now, with the affirmations three times, come on. I tune into my good. I celebrate my power. I savor my good fortune. It serves as my honor. Come on, again. I tune into my good. I celebrate my power. I savor my good fortune to serve as my honor one last time. I tune into my good. I celebrate my power. I can say I savor my good fortune to serve as my honor. Yes, yes. Arms up. Arms up. Arms up and just feel. Just feel. Just feel what you're feeling in this moment and bring your arms down and bring your arms down and bring them back up and down and up and down. Continue doing this as I find my next cool down song. Down and up and down and up and down and up and down there you go up and down and bring your hands to your heart oh, volume and just feel yourself just feel yourself and your heartbeat. And your heartbeat. We have worked so hard. You worked so hard today. Awesome job. <clears throat> awesome job. It's not easy sometimes to really recognize the goodness in us. It's not easy to celebrate our power because so often we're just conditioned to really conditioned to think that we are not enough, that we're not doing enough, that we should be doing more. And today you've declared that just the way you are is enough, just what you're doing is enough because you're doing all you can do. If you could be doing more, you would be doing more. You are exactly where you need to be. And you're doing exactly what you need to be doing. And to declare the goodness in us and to declare the celebration of our power has us really move forward in a different way. So instead of shooting us that we should be doing this, we should be doing that, we're actually inspired and we're, we feel like we are capable of doing that. You are so capable. And sometimes we really are limited by our own mind that is dragging us down. That's the most exhausting part of our whole being is our mind telling us something. Our mind telling us that we should do this. Our mind telling us that we're not good enough. So our mind telling us that we should be doing this so that we can achieve that. And the goal is to really go inside of us, inside of our hearts, and recognize that we are doing all we can and when we focus on our hearts, we can do all we, we can be all we are. And that's really the goal. Because we are good. You are good. You are so good. You are so good. And you are so powerful. You are so powerful. Savor your good fortune of where you are in your life right now. Savor the good fortune that you are able to watch this. If you are able to watch this, 
you are okay, you are more than okay because you are in possession of a device that allows you to connect you to yourself to the internet and to the rest of the world. That is a privilege. That is a privilege. So let's take this privilege to serve. And sometimes when we think of serving, it seems to be this huge, humongous thing that we need to join a nonprofit and serve the world and change the world. But it really starts with us here in this moment. You showing up and feeding into the collective energy of bringing our good to the world. That is your act of service today for this moment. You showing up for work if you have work in this moment. That is an act of service. You showing up for your kids is an act of service. You showing up for yourself is an act of service in the world because you never know who you're going to touch. Just by being you, you are innately serving, serving this world. So let's do it consciously because you're doing it anyway, either way. So let's do it consciously. Let's tune in into our good and consciously bring forth our passions because all we can ever strive to do in life and all we can ever want in life is to live a fulfilled happy and joyous life and there is no reason no reason whatsoever why we wouldn't be entitled and have the right to live our lives to live our lives in the most joyful and happy way possible that's our only job. When we are happy, we bring our best self forth. We tune into the good that is in, in us and we harness that power that we can bring to the world. That comes from a place of satisfaction, of a place of fulfillment, of happiness. So our only job truly is to make ourselves happy, to be happy, to be ourselves. your whole body as these words penetrate your conscience consciousness and feel the blood flow in your body how you feel different than before before taking this class before turning on your computer your phone or your TV how alive we feel and how present we are Sometimes I feel like my mind is actually a complete zoo up there that is taking over my whole life. And then I remember that I have the power to be present. Take a deep breath in and a little more and a little more and a little more. Expand that prana, that life force inside of your lungs and exhale. And one more breath in. And a little more, and a little more, and a little more, and exhale. And a third time, take a deep breath in, and expand it, and expand it, and sip in more, sip in more, sip in more, and expand it, expand it in your lungs, in your heart, in your legs, through your arms, in your brain, through your skin, and into the world, into the world, and exhale. And breathe normally, and open your eyes. And welcome back. Welcome back to the room. Thank you so much for being here, Ariana. I know you're on. Sorry was on. Whoever is on, thank you for, for joining us, uh, for joining me this morning. I am so happy to have this slot, this time slot. Tell your friends, tell everybody who wants to, <clears throat> who wants to really start the day in a very powerful way that um, we are here, uh, some of us are here at 9.30. I am definitely here every Thursday. And I thank you for showing up and I thank you for being here. Mari was on, oh my God, hi Mari. I miss you, yay, yay, thank you Ariana. Um, thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you next Thursday. Don't forget that on every Saturday at 10 a.m. we have a Zoom class of Intensati with Patricia, with the founder of Intensati. Um, go to intensatilive.splashdat.com to sign up. It is an amazing experience. We are 400 people uh, doing this practice from all over the world, literally all over the world and tuning in and speaking the affirmations together and moving together. And it is just such a an incredible way of coming together if you feel and you, if you can think of 
each and every one of us from all over the world at the same time bringing that energy to the world we literally create a whole envelopment of positivity in the world so please share it please show up please contribute because everybody is important each and every one of us is important so please please come and join us and otherwise uh, we are here on youtube every day and you can watch the replay if you're watching the replay welcome to you too and i'll see you next thursday